Hello guys, welcome to the course on Unix shell scripting and this video I will get you introduced Sed. So Sed is an acronym for Stream Editor which is a powerful text parsing and transformation tool. Sed is available in most of the Unix based operating system. So mainly Sed uh, is used for uh, selective printing and text substitution. So first uh, we will I will get you introduced about one option that we can use along with the set uh, that is D, D for delete particular line or based on the matching we can delete one particular line and print the remaining portion. So for that I have an input file called input.txt so these are the contents if you look it's around uh, 2, 4, uh, 6, 8, 10 lines available. <coughs> So I want to print, I want to delete one particular line so by using the line number and print the remaining line. So for that I can use Z, then 1D, 1D stands for delete the first line. So this line will get deleted and uh, print the remaining lines. Okay. So the first line, whatever the line number we mentioned here, that will get deleted and uh, remaining portion so this will be printed as a result sorry uh, i need to put a space here so you can see uh, this started printing from shell script ecc to learn and so onwards so this line is deleted and if i use a two or a three whatever i i use four so basically one two three uh, four this unix is good that will be deleted okay so here you can see unix is good and uh, but that is not there but Perl is easy to learn and uh, the python coding so you can delete any line using this option suppose if you want to uh, delete set of lines say for example line number two to five or three to six like that so this is my input file so in that case I can use Z. Uh, I just need uh, line number 1, 2, 3. I can use 1, comma 3, then delete and my input file. So these three lines will delete it and it start from Unix is good to last line. Okay. So we can delete uh, one uh, between some lines. So for example, if I if I want uh, to delete uh, line number two to five so this will line uh, this will remove the line two three four and five so the remaining lines will get printed and uh, okay let me just uh, take a copy of input dot txt org original one and this changes if i want to make in the same file i can use iphone i flag so if you use iphone i flag instead of printing so whatever the changes we did will be updated into this file okay so there were 10 lines so those lines are removed and it will do an inline way that means this input will be replaced okay let me just recover this file from this input. and uh, again let me show another example Let's say for example if you you have i want to just uh, select or search with a shell and wherever this shell is coming those lines need to be removed so here i have uh, two uh, i think uh, places where i the shell is coming okay let me just check what are the places it, uh, this shell is coming i can just use see basically i have two line okay so this is uh, uh, shell based where is that line uh, yeah this is the shell based and shell scripting so if i use a set then i can do the searching here whatever the value i need to search shell and to d then use this input file so it will match whenever this shell is there remove those line I uh, D option is used for deleting those particular line so you can see all the contents or all the lines with the 
which is matching with this shell is removed okay so basically uh, this line this is shell based and shell script is easy to those two lines are removed since that is matching with the, this string so for example i want to uh, delete only uh, that you can instead of simple string you can use a regular expression here so this caret symbol shell means the shell is at the starting of the string so we have two cases one is in the middle and one is in the starting so the starting will match so this line will be there but only this line will get removed okay but uh, you can see this is shell base that is still there but the other shell script is easy to learn that as removed and next is <coughs> i don't want the lines between pearl and practice so for example you have some keywords and in between whatever the lines or whatever the contents you don't need Li i mean including the lines so in that case what you can do is set then use this one comma then again what is the ending practice then delete whatever the input file so use this option you can see the line number between the pearl and practice so that means pearl and practice these four lines are removed so this is a shell based example and then unix is good so this way you can remove uh, the multiple lines okay which are matching with this pearl and practice so whatever the lines coming including the pearl and practice matching both line will be deleted and whatever the line in between these two lines so you can use this option i hope this is clear and uh, we will meet in the next video where we will discuss more about some other options that we can use with this set thank you for watching we'll see you in the next video